What's going on everyone? Welcome back to State 48 Turtle and Tortoise. I am Hayden. Today we are accompanied by my beautiful baby Heidi. And uh, today I just wanted to give you guys a quick little update video. I've got Heidi with me. We're going to go ahead and walk around and show you guys what's going on. What's new turtles and tortoises. What all we have here and uh, yeah. So um, as you guys know we've got the and again guys I am lacking hands today. We have got the water turtles. Here we have two Clive Line albino red eared sliders. And these two albinos you see are Clive Line female albino red eared sliders. And then in the water, deep dark depths somewhere, we have three 100% het albino red eared sliders that look completely normal, obviously. And then we've got these beauties. And here, two albino sulcatas into 66% het albino sulcatas, which are actually sold. Uh, I apologize for the film footage, but um, those are sold to Mike Thorne. Those are gonna be shipped out to him, hopefully at the end of the week, just trying to get the uh, shipping materials here as quick as possible so we can get those shipped out to him. Um, he's got a lot of cool animals, a lot of cool uh, albino sulcatas. Um, here's their house. It's usually their winter house, but it's their summer house now. Still gotta put the roof on it, or back on it, I guess. Um, Heidi. Say hi. Too beautiful. Um, we've got the chickens. We've got albino sulcatas. There's 10 of them out here. This is one of the biggest females. Another big female. We just measured her the other day. She's about 18. Obviously getting close to that female. Female, one of the original ones. Um, that's a female albino sulcata. We've got the chickens, eggs. But this is my biggest male albino sulcata. Uh, I've actually, it's, <laughs> Believe it or not, I have seen him out breeding or attempting to breed twice now. That's just me watching, right? One of the times though, however, he flipped over on his back um, and was on his back when I looked at the camera. It's about a half hour. Luckily he survived. He wasn't in the sun or anything because he's been attempting to breed in the evenings, which is great uh, because then the sun's not out as bad. And uh, if anything happens, I usually am home to check on him. And also uh, the sun's not gonna cook him. Heidi dropped her binky chickens think it's great put that in my pocket and then we got a small little uh, albino sulcata over there um, that I don't know the gender of Heidi is very enthused by the chickens I think it's the first the closest she's ever been to them they're begging me for food right now but that's exciting news that he's trying to breathe and the other time that he didn't flip over um, he was on the front of the tortoise so i mean that's some people like that i guess i don't know um really wow tortoise has already started digging right there i just put this piece of wood here yesterday so the digging saga continues here got the watering faucet thing there migrated around we've got another female female that's the biggest female she's a hair over 18 and this is my second biggest male that guy over there um i haven't seen any breeding action out of him but I have seen him uh, flash his goods to me once before. Um, if you guys were counting, that should have been 10 albino sulcatas there. Um, guys, just a quick reminder, don't forget to subscribe. Go look at the 500 subscriber video if you haven't already. I'm gonna try and put the card at the end of this video. Um, but if you haven't seen that video, we'll let Heidi look at the chickens. Um, if you haven't seen that video, go watch it and get yourself subscribed and comment down below so you can get a chance to some free merch. Guys, these shirts are so fire. The logo turned out amazing. Um, and I want you guys all to be able to enjoy this. But last but not least, turtles we have are the bum, 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 two three-toed box turtles, which these three-toed box turtles were gifts from one of my clients. Um, they have a whole herd of them in their backyard. They just breed and breed and breed every year. And I told them that I was a freaking turtle nerd. And they said, hey, when they wake up in the springtime, you can have some. And now that's been over over a year that I've had them now. And I love the box turtles. I literally think they're the best starter pet turtle or pet turtle for anyone to have because they're so easy to care for. They eat everything, diet, everything is just so easy. So if you're looking for a starter turtle, definitely look into uh, box turtles three-toed box turtles are pretty common and pretty inexpensive um but guys i think that's gonna be the video for today my hands are kind of uh 
kind of tied with this little beauty here, but um, I appreciate your support. If you guys could please click that subscribe button. I know every, all, every YouTuber begs you to do it, but if you guys could help me get to a thousand subscribers, um, I've got like, what, three, four months left before the end of the year. We could make it happen, guys. We're growing. We've uh, gained 90 subscribers in the past 28 days, which is pretty huge. Some of the biggest growth I've experienced. So if we can continue on that trend, there's a good chance we can make it to 1,000 subscribers. But I'm not good, good at math. Um, but anywho, guys, appreciate y'all so much. If you want to order some merch, interested in a shirt, let me know. If you did already order merch, I just got it all in. Uh, life is busy. I'll try and get it shipped out here at the end of the week. If not, beginning of next. But I will be in contact with you guys as far as finalizing payment and shipping information um but you guys are the greatest i appreciate you as always you guys have a wonderful wonderful rest of your day and heidi and i and turtles and tortoises we'll see you guys next time peace